Hello everyone, what is going on and welcome back to my channel for another video today. Now today I've got another gameplay for you and it is another hardcore gameplay because again I still do prefer hardcore on this game at the minute than I do core. I've still got another two core gameplays to post which is a new quiff for Maddox and a new quiff for Air Vapor. But I've been playing a lot of hardcore and I find it honestly a lot more easy, a lot more enjoyable and overall just a lot more fun. I just enjoy hardcore a lot more than core in this game. Now you might be thinking, Jack, that's that's not your gameplay, it's not you are not on your juggernaut account, what's this? Now basically you if you know if you like keep up date with me and my friends in D7 personally, you'll know we have a member called PPX. Now PPX was um on Xbox, but he decided to switch to PlayStation 4. And what Tom or Desire, the owner of D7, did is he decided to buy the account what PPX had on Xbox and then change it to a team account, which is why it's called YT, in the, YT Space District 7. Now, on this account, where I play on it, Tom plays on it, Luncy, Oblivion, pretty much anyone in D7 who can, like, if they're free, will hop on for a few games and rank the account up. Now, yes, this is technically account sharing, but to be honest, like, Ryan's done this solo up until, like, level 700 and, like, I think 40. So, it's not as if we've account shared the whole way. Now, obviously, we're not denying the fact that we're on the account sharing now, but it was mostly done by Ryan. And we did this before because of a few reasons. One, because of, obviously, I mean, if Ryan's on PlayStation, he's hardly ever going to use the Xbox anymore. And two, because of the fact that we um, want a team account, so next year, for next year's Call of Duty, um, we, could, like, we could do the race if we have the roster capable to do it. And it's overall ha good to have a nice stacked account, because I know on BO3 it's level 1000 in multiplayer, it's um, level 1000 in zombies. I mean, I don't mind going back on this account and getting it into MP30 on Infinite Warfare either, so I'm sure with like, Jay and people don't mind doing that. So, it would be alright to have a stacked account. Now, this gameplay is actually a double nuclear choke I got. I think it was in a 5-man in Hardcore KC, and I was just running this spawn myself. And this is actually the first time I've ever ran a spawn, like, as such, like, people who, like, pub stomp and trap know what that means. Like, first time I've actually ran a spawn solo. Like, I'm not normally a one to say, like, oh, let us have that spawn, because I'm not usually that greedy. But to be honest, I'm going to have to start doing it more, because... First time I've ran spawn solo and I've choked a double nuke. Now I got a, I was 39 and over, 38 gun streak, and I walked into barbed wire and died. <sighs> I know, it was devastating. And then I went on another 24, ran in again to some more barbed wire, got one shot, and died to a pistol. So this was. This game could have easily been a double nuke or a high, re like a really high gun streak. Obviously, using the GKS, the standard GKS, the long barrel, extended mags, grip, quick draw, scavenger, gung ho, and equipment charge. I was using Ajax obviously because Ajax is super strong and hardcore. And the way we was doing this is just I was running spawns and I had crash. Uh, no, my friends had crash, Lazarus and Fours both had crash, and we're just stacking health. So I think at one point on this game, I was on like maybe 210 health, which is absolutely ridiculous. Now, if you didn't know about that, I want a quick tutorial video. Um, I'll make it next video if you just want a quick tutorial on how to get like 400 health in hardcore. So, if you do want to know, please just let me know in the comment section below. And that's where I unfortunately walked into the barbed wire. Right? Now, I'll let you watch the rest of the gameplay in peace. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Again, thank you so much for watching. And peace.